Anthony Towns and Rudy Gobert back after missing game two due to the birth of his son Romeo and we are underway. Murray inside to Jokic Porter Jr. run off the three point line and he misses his first jumper underneath Gordon back out to Caldwell Pope a long two is good. A quick start is going to be time in game two. Just three of 18 shooting. A total of eight points. Got into the paint, elevates and scores it. Right now playing on a bad wheel, that sore calf muscle. I love that two-man set. That's a tough one for KCP because you've got a big guy handling the basketball. You don't want to use a hand check on a guy that's not really going anywhere. Anthony Edwards continues to torch the Nets. Averaging 35 points a game in the two games so far in the series. Simply put, they have no answer for him. He's been the best player in the series. Jokic sprays it out to the wing. Gordon, he had a big first quarter, Tim, in game two in double figures. He did, and he's going to have that shot whenever he wants. That is something that Minnesota is going to concede to make sure you've got an extra body in the paint. Wow, Tap with a deep pull. Looks at his dad, Carl Sr., courtside, as they always do. And Minnesota up by a bucket. Throw your body into the chest and beg for a call, and he gets one early. Jokic took only 13 field goal attempts, Tim, in that game two defeat. Murray off the screen, pocket pass, one more. And there's Aaron Gordon from that dunker spot so lethal. Yeah, lurking behind, get his hands on, and it comes off to Porter Jr. Michael Porter Jr. held to just nine points in game two. Here he is working on the perimeter by the four-time defensive player of the year, Rudy Gobert. Good contest by the Timberwolves, and Murray made a great decision to get his man an open shot. Much like game two, two different Timberwolves in the air to contest, but Jamal Murray, very patient that time, gets Michael Porter Jr. an open look. Here's Cat on the pick and pop, and he's two for two. The self-proclaimed best shooting big in the world knocks down his second consecutive three. Tied at nine so far, Tim. It's exactly what Michael Malone said. He was emphasizing not who has been impenetrable as a defender will check in T it's Denver against Minnesota game four and good morning in Minneapolis he's the wizard of Nas around here there's no question about it when I was out walking around today and Edwards with the rebound Denver leading by two off the pin down Edwards pocket pass picture perfect Great. Off the nice flare screen, Caldwell Pope. Gordon got the rebound. And Porter Jr. with the lay in. Yeah, Aaron Gordon making his presence felt here early. That's a great offense. Edwards. Connolly with a nice show and go. That's his shot, the offhand floater. He's a lefty, but he makes it at a high rate. And Denver can live with that. You can't defend that any better. That was a great closeout by Michael Porter Jr. Covered a lot of ground. You force a tough runner off the dribble. Michael Malone will take that. Murray dancing off the dribble. Good contest by Reed, but a better shot by Murray. Getting to his spots a little bit better so far in these first eight and a half minutes of the game. He didn't get any daylight yeah. in game two. Here's Reed off the flare. Got downhill and lays it home. Nas Reed is on the sheet with his first bucket. He was so important for this Timberwolves team from the field so far. After taking just 13 shots in the previous game, maybe.